It's a tough play. It's almost Shakespeare's trailer of all his films because you've got a romance, a comedy, a treachery, revenge, and all of that, and compassion. Has thou spirit performed to the point the tempest that I bade thee? I boarded the king's ship. In every cabin, I flamed amazement. I think Shakespeare would have loved it. The primary difference is, is Prospero being played by a woman. It shifts the gears in the, in the play but I think in a very, very good way. It was a, such a privilege to work for someone who obviously is revered so much. At first sight, they have changed eyes. Do you love me? Beyond all limit. They are both in either's powers. It's just great training for a young actor like myself, you know, to work with Helen Mirren, Alfred Molina, Jaiman Hansu, everybody. And Davis for Theron plays my father, the king. It's sort of intimidating on one hand, but such a great learning experience. It's extraordinarily privileged to work with Helen Mirren. It's an education, it's a sex education, it's an elevation. It's like being gently embalmed with frankincense. It's like walking on clouds. It's like being plunged into the Earth's core and then rescued by a worm army. Misery acquaints a man with strange bedfellows. <gasps> oh. Looking for business, governor. <laughs> Hast thou not dropped from heaven? Out of the moon, I do assure thee. Caliban! I think Julie is very interesting with her casting. She doesn't cast in an obvious way at all. She has a, quite a, a radical look. Julie Taymor, I think, is a visionary and a genius. I suppose you have to be those things to be a director. She don't see the world in normal ways. I think she's, a, you know, like in The Matrix, when he sees everything all as numbers, after she sees the world like that, I think she understands the world in a subatomic way. For people who know The Tempest, this will be a new experience, a new opening on the language, on the ideas, on the relationships. I have made you mad. We are such stuff as dreams are made on, and our little life is rounded with a sleep.